Hello everyone, Penguin Sal here again today. We are back rocking more Backpack Hero. So, we just did our first look the last time we played. We built up our store. Game seems like it's going to be pretty good. So, we're going to click this Go Adventuring and see what happens. Okay, so there's a character select. Purse, a peppy rat from a poor village in Oakshire Forest. James the Storm the Dungeon, rebuild her village and save her family. So, we don't have anybody else yet. So, we are going to be Purse. What the heck is this? A basic run with no special settings. Reward a this. Okay. Well, it gives us this cheese, which we can sell, which we did last time. So, let's see. I'm curious if we keep the stuff that we had before or if we restart. Okay, we restarted. But I wonder if we have everything that we brought back with us, though, like back at the town. I'm not sure. So, we're back to square one. Okay, they're doing 7 damage, which means a little bit of a little blocky, a little double wacky. You know what? I could have just did that, I guess, and not blocked. I hate reorganize. I do want that, though. What if I just eat this? I do a little double block action. I hit you. Hit you. Oh, it costs three energy to do that, apparently. Interesting. I did want that rose. But what are you going to do? So it straight up costs three. It's not it uses what you have left. It costs three. It's good to know. Because I was like, we did that once before, and I was like, whoops. We get four spaces. Give me some cool stuff. We have an armor. You know we love that. Gives us max HP. I don't really care. I like that. Let's do a little of this and this. I mean, for now, I guess. It doesn't heal us, though. So, like... That's really kind of just ass. That's genuinely kind of stuck. Here to do a trade. His cloak billows as he steps out from the shadows. We can make a trade, you and I. You know risks are involved. Get a different item of the same rarity. He takes your item from the... He takes your item and from his cloak pulls out a replacement. I mean, I guess it's technically better. What a sucker. I mean, technically, the thing he gave us was better. I might as well go here, use it in this battle. Okay, so they're doing 15, so we will have to double block. Uh, get hit with a little of that. Oh, he's raged. Well, I'm going to just kill him, so... So they're only doing 6. So I will block a single time and then whack. Bring it on, chump. Go back. Hey, we leveled up. Aren't we cool? You win. Okay, the double halberd. Well, the machete we know is really good. What's this? For each row below, get plus one block. So, like... If it's there, it gives us that. It's interesting. Excuse me. So, that gives us four. That gives us six. That gives us six. Sixteen. Wait, I do like the machete. But I think 16 block every turn is pretty good. Let's ride. What is that? The dungeon is collapsing here. What the hell does that mean? It, that spot just exploded. What the hell was that? Are we going to get trapped in here? I would not like that if that were the case. Die. 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 Bring it on, chief. Okay, he's doing 12. We have 16, so... Get whacked. Nice triple attack, chump. We have a key. 
Another flower. I'm a little afraid because the dungeon's collapsing. Maybe it was just that one space. I guess we check this chest. See if there's anything cool. Oh, it was a mimic! Hermit crab mimic. Look can be deceiving indeed. Get whacked. Get whacked. Hey, presents. We don't have any space. We needed one more experience point to level up. Which we did not get. Sadly. The Crypt, part two of three. Ooh. What's this? Hark! You are greeted by a member of the patrol. Squirrel looks at you absent-mindedly. Long ago, I retired from the patrol, he says. Now I spent my days adventuring and reliving my glory days. I don't need much of my old equipment anymore. Can I interest you in something? Hmm. He reaches in and pulls out a weapon. That looks cool. The Bee Sting Blade can be used once per turn, deals 10 damage. When an item in this column is used, this item is refreshed and can be used again this turn. Interesting. That seems cool, but I can't really fit it anywhere. Like... I mean, that's technically better, because now that's next to both of these. Hmm, when an item in the column is used, it's refreshed. It does cost an energy, though, so it's not, like, insane. They can only be used once per turn. Like, I kind of think it's cool. I don't think it's much better, though. Sorry, boss. I'll go collect it over on the ground. Give me experience. Hey, that means we leveled up. Can we only level up in battle? Oh, no, okay. I, was, I, I thought maybe we could only level up in battle. Um, I don't know. At least that gives us a little space. What is this? A merchant selling goods. I'll just do a fight. Ah! Okay, you guys are you guys aren't messing around, huh? See, if only we got that first, because I could have put the blade here. Okay, so you guys are doing 21. So I really only need to do this. Whack you a couple of times. Enjoy my thorns, Klaus. Uh, what the? Reactive. Removed at the end of the turn. When 14 damage is received... He will go to a different thing. Um, you can block instead, clown. You're doing six. I'm going to just hit this guy again then. I, was like, I didn't like that at all. Okay, I think I could just kill you. Like, I can just go a little bit like bang, bang, bang. Easy. Bring it on. Oh, you're going to try to do big hit, huh? How about die, die, die? Let's see if your block saves you now. Okay, we have some space. A letter. Moves up one space. Adjacent weapons get plus six. Oh yeah, I remember this actually being pretty cool. What's this? When combat ends, add luck. Maybe. I'll take a present. I'll take a luck. What's this? On damage, add seven spikes to self. I guess I'll take that for now. I remember the present actually being pretty cool. Or not the present, the uh, letter. And it blesses everyone here. Oh, thank you. Have a mistletoe. Weapons below get plus one charm. Okay, so I need to do a little bit like... Something like that. So this has charm now, whatever that is. Thanks, boss. That looks like gold. Thanks for the monies. 
That looks like healing. I don't need to go to the merchant lab yet. I don't have any space. I will just go kill. Ah! Okay, so we have 18 black. They are doing 16 damage, so... I'll just hit you with a little bit of this. You could get this. Bluff Kai Sigil. This item has a use in Haversack Hill. Wait, I want that. I can't tell how big it is, though. I kind of want it, though. How big is this? It's only one. Okay. Do this, maybe. Like, this has a use, which means I want that. We are going to get hurt here a little bit. I'm willing to take that trade, though. Because I wanted to see what that was. Die. I don't know what charm does. If an enemy has more charm than health, they will fight for the player. What the hell? What the heck is this? Clean burn. Must be played on an item. Remove 100% of all status effects on self. Items this is played on are destroyed. Interesting. No thank you, but interesting. That's one of the things. I don't know how much this game ch game changed since we played the demo. Because the game had... Oh. They were fighting for us because they were charmed. That's funny. Okay, that's that thing. I mean, a second that isn't bad. A cap is interesting. Adjacent diagonal armor gets plus one. Another cap. I kind of would rather have this. I feel like there's a world where, like, that could be potentially not terrible. Let's ride. Hello, bads. You guys are doing 15 damage. So... Let me just do a little bit of this. Oh yeah, I don't have any thorns right now. Something to consider. Okay, and let's see. Uh, you guys are doing seven. I'll just whack you a bit. I don't have any thorns. Because we got rid of our rose and our hurting thing. Block for me, chump. Block for me. Oh. Attack for me. Oh, you guys are so boned. Okay, so they do it for... Oh, because their charm went down by one. Interesting. Interesting. So... Why did that guy's charm go up? Fight for me! This is hilarious. Get him. Charm is amazing. Like, what the hell? Char I love charm, man. That's so funny. Charm is very funny. I like that a lot. We got a lucky beasting blade. We got another lucky ring. A bronze breastplate. A present. Okay, I'm thinking I want the lucky ring. I don't think I actually need this. I do want the present. Maybe it'll give me another mistletoe. We could get more armor. Deals four damage. Honestly, sure. Might as well. I don't need it or care, but... Okay, let's see. Are you health? Yep. Go to the merchant. See if they have anything cool. What's that? A hard hat for each hazard. What the hell? Dynamite. What is this? When destroyed, it deals 20 to all. Okay, I see. So, you have to have a way to destroy it. Oh, yeah. Structures are weird. Like, this is... Each turn, get plus one block for each structure. 
So you have to like build, like you have to like stack a bunch of them on top of each other. Reversal amulet. For each hazard in this row, I don't know what hazards are. I'm assuming it's bad things that they add to my deck. The cloud sword. This floats. For each adjacent or diagonal structure, it gets damage. Interesting. I really want none of this. I'm going to give this guy a present, though. He did give me another mistletoe. Aren't you sweet? Now we've got three charm. What is that? Apparently there was a chest here. What do we got? We got lucky. A dark whetstone can be used once per turn. Weapons in this row get plus one weak. Interesting. I mean, I guess that's way better than that, right? Like, so we can use this once per turn, and it would give our weapon a week. Sure. I would attempt it. Bring it on, chump. The Crypt Finale. Ooh. Hey, get over here. What the heck is that? We'll summon an enemy. Okay. Okay. You're doing 8 damage. You get the rage when you get attacked. This does 7. So I could just steal you, right? Like, I could just go bop, bop, bop. And you will attack for me this turn. Huge damage. How come you got charmed? Like, they got charmed when this guy attacked. I don't know. Okay, you're going to summon and add block. Well, what if I steal your guy? Man, charm is insane. I'm going to just do this, I think. So now this adds weak. Bang, bang. Bees? Get her. What is that? When this ends, items... What the heck? Unused, destroyed. When your turn ends, items behind are anchored. Okay, I'm gonna just kill you, I think. What is that? Adds a poison. I don't like the sound of that. Yeah, I'll just kill you. I didn't like the sound of that. No! You stole them back. Now I have to kill them. Now I have to kill. Let's dark whetstone again for fun. Bang. Because you are... Will reduce two damage when attacking. Yeah. Ah, I've been poisoned. I did take poison damage. Let's do a little that, that, that. You're mine now. We've had this one B on our side this entire time. Alright. Bang. 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 Charm is nuts, man. What the hell? Try telling me charm isn't absolutely insane. What are we doing? We're like looking in our bag. What is this? A chest of valuables. Let me guess. It has that cheese. Does have our cheese. I guess I can get rid of a lucky ring. And take our cheese. The mistletoe is insane. I mean we just had all those bees fight for us. I loved that. Hello. Well, you're back again. I am. You're never going to stop going there, are you? I will once Haversack Hill is rebuilt. I can't sit still while my home falls apart. This place hasn't been the same since the King's Raids. If it wasn't for my bad leg, King would have conscripted me. And then you'd be all alone, purse. If something happened to you after losing Prada, I don't think I could live... Oh, Prada, probably. Like the devil wears. I don't think I could live here without you. I miss Mom, too. I'm sorry I worry you, Dad, but you know I have to do this. I know, Purse. Who's this guy? Quill Swish. Have you contributed to my campaign for mayor? You're running for mayor? We have a mayor? Not yet, you don't. I am Mayor Quillfish Jr., and I intend to be the next mayor. My father, Lord Quill Swish. I said Quillfish, I think. Quill Swish II was the mayor of Aversack back before it fell into despair. 
All this time I've been waiting for my claim to my birthright. And now that my town is recovering, I have returned. Yes, you've done all the adventuring and fighting and risking your life. But someone has to handle the true risk. The voting public. The first thing I need is a small donation. Let's say ten pieces of treasure. Do you have some treasure I can have? I just need about ten. Screw you. This towel never developed without a proper mirror. The stuff you bring back always sells. You find amazing things down there. You can hold on to stuff forever if you want. But I recommend selling as much as you can. Maybe if we keep selling stuff, someone who will stop by will know something about my mom. It could happen. Of course, getting you deeper in the dungeon is going to help too. I've got some powerful equipment. I can start you with this stuff. Ooh, a new quest. Energy delivery. You start with these items. The run ends after area one. So we get a token of energy. When an adjacent or diagonal item is present, it's disabled. Each turn it adds an energy. Interesting. So it doesn't want anything diagonal to it. A slats shield. On use at eight block. Okay. And a wooden sword. But we'll get a lost a lost spark and a cornucopia. Interesting. Use it to get through at least three floors of the dungeon, you'll get a reward. Okay. Okay, so yeah, we do still have all the stuff we collected before. So like I can sell cheese. Bang. Did I do it? No. Bang. So am I supposed to sell all of this stuff too? I guess technically. Like, because I don't know if I can... That can't be sold. It's needed for something. But what? Hey, who's up here? Vivian, the librarian. Librarian here reporting for duty. I was told that Haversack Hill is getting quite large. But still no library. We need to change that. We can learn about powerful relics here. For each commercial decoration nearby, it gets efficiency. Once you build one, we can really learn new things about the history of this place. Oh, I should also mention that I'm an expert on many languages that are written across Ordaria. If you find anything to translate, it should be labeled as a lore item. Bring it to me and I will be happy to translate it for you. Do you have anything for me to read? May the pages of life be filled with knowledge. Thank you. I would like to make a uh, library. We don't have enough. We do not have enough to make said library. I'll have to see, because I still don't know if it makes sense to sell the items I have or not. Or if I can use them again for something. I genuinely don't know. Like... And this guy said he needs treasure. Like... I'll repeat after you. Whenever you're ready. I don't think I know the oath. It goes like this. I, Purse, adventurer and settler, do hereby swear in Mayor Quillswish Jr. in the duly confirmed title of Mayor. Therefore, I now appoint you Mayor Mayor Quillswish Jr. Mayor Mayor. Your first name's Mayor? It's my birthright, and it's a family name. As for you, I can see that you are well prepared to handle this town. Allow me to help. You can build as many of these things as you want. A farm creates five food while you're in the dungeon. For each farmland tile nearby, gets efficiency. Farms will create food while you're out adventuring. Increases the population. How many animals have returned to Ordaria? New unlocks are available by increasing population. And houses will attract new villagers. We can't expand forever, though. The costs will keep rising. Is this farmland? No, that's a path. It said it got efficiency for farmland. Rubble. Destroy it to make more space. Oh, we need that much population to destroy this stuff, huh? Holy crow, you need a lot of population to destroy this junk. Like, the farm said they wanted to be near farmland. But I don't know what the heck farmland looks like. Uh... Like, it makes me think if I want to build a farm, I should do it away from everything. That increases population. That increases food. Oh, and they both use 10 hammer. 
So I can only really do one of these things. I guess I could build a farm. Yes, I don't really know what the heck. Can I build bridges, do you think? Because otherwise, I don't think I can get over here. It's got water all the way around. I don't know. I guess I should place it somewhere I can get to for now. Okay, so it's going to give us some extra food. Interesting. Okay, I guess that's going to do it for, for this one, though. Like I said, I've really been enjoying this, so I definitely am going to keep delving in. Please let me know in the comments if you guys want to keep seeing Backpack Hero. I definitely want to keep playing it and see what it has to offer. Also, feel free to like the video if you enjoyed this. Feel free to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And you'd like to keep up to date with all the cool Backpack Hero stuff we do. And, you know, all the other cool indie game first looks and everything. I appreciate you guys watching this. I'll catch you in the next one.